Hello Gemini, welcome to Fantasy Lighthouse, welcome to my channel and welcome to another energy reading. Today we'll be taking a look at the recent past, the present and the future in reference to a love connection that continues to challenge you to book your private reading with me. All of that info is below along with all of the price listings. Private readings with me are an hour long. The best way to be notified as to when I put out any new content is by following me on Instagram. The link to my IG is below and as always, not each and every Gemini watching me will feel like this is their story and that's okay. It's impossible for me to be able to connect with each and every Gemini in this world. All right, let's see what's going on. Spirit, please speak to me in reference to the recent past when it comes to Gemini and the energy that they are dealing with. Please speak to me in reference to the recent past when it comes to Gemini and the energy that they're dealing with. Talk to me about Gemini. Please speak to me in reference to Gemini and the energy that they're dealing with, please. Talk to me about Gemini. Talk to me about Gemini and, all right. King of Wands energy could be dealing with a fire sign, an Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius. Someone who's arrogant, cocky, thinks that they have all of the answers. Okay. Tell me more about Gemini and this person for the recent past. Tell me more about who this person is for Gemini. Even more fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Two of Wands. But I just get that they're being very stubborn right now. They don't want to talk in the recent past here. So there's something that they said that could have turned you off. All right. And now... For some reason, in the recent past, they also aren't communicating enough. They aren't speaking up about something. They have their mind made up, very stubborn energy, really pissed off is what I get here, or just really in their feelings. Talk to me about the present when it comes to Gemini and this person, Sagittarius energy coming out here, Gemini. What happened? Talk to me about Sagittarius energy coming out here in the present moment. I feel like you want peace with this Sagittarius. If it's not a Sagittarius, then you want peace with this person in the present moment, but they're pissed off about something in the recent past. Tell me more about Gemini and this person. The Six of Pentacles in reverse. So there's no reciprocity. Something is imbalanced here. You're trying to make it more balanced, but they disagree. There's a disagreement about something here. We have Earth Energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay. Talk to me about this Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. When it comes to Gemini. Talk to me about... Queen of Wands, this person, they need to watch the things that they say, okay? I just feel like somebody is very combative. Somebody feels like they have to defend themselves all of the time. Someone is rude. Someone isn't giving enough. Hmm. Let's talk about the future when it comes to Gemini and the energy that they're dealing with. Talk to me about the future. Queen of Swords, there you are. All right, so there's something that you have to say to this person in the future. Looks like you get the opportunity to actually do that. If you guys can't stop thinking about each other here with the Capricorn energy. So you feel chained to one another? Tell me more about the future when it comes to Gemini and the person that they're dealing with, please. Ooh. Yeah, there's definitely some sort of communication here about 
the fact that you both can't move on from this. So even if this person is over here being standoffish, I still feel like you guys are going to be having a conversation in the future. And it has to do with the fact that you guys keep coming back to each other. All right, with this Capricorn energy. So it's not something that you can easily let go. Okay. Tell me more about the future when it comes to Gemini's person. Tell me more about Gemini's person, please. Now we have Cancer energy. So your person is acting like they want to move on, but I feel like that's a front, Gemini, honestly. Somebody is acting like they just wanna keep it moving, that they wanna move on with their life, but I don't feel like that's really true. Clarify this Cancer energy for Gemini. Please speak to me in reference to this Cancer energy for Gemini. Whoa, that's way too much. But you know what? I'm being told to take it, so I'm going to take it. Judgment. The Eight of Cups. Somebody is walking away here from a commitment. Somebody's leaving. Somebody's leaving everything. Why is someone here walking away from a commitment and where are they going? Let me ask that and then we'll wrap We'll wrap this up. Please speak to me in reference to who's walking away here and why. Why? Please speak to me as to why somebody's walking away here. Whoa. Because they're tired of feeling stuck. So I feel like you're tired of feeling mentally trapped to this energy, which is why you probably want to give up here. Bottom of the deck, you're done with the pain. And I just feel like someone is just not going to deal with all of these people. There's just too many people involved and you're aware of it, which is why you're not interested is what I get. All right, so that's what I have for you, Gemini. Thank you for watching. To find out more about this story or any other issue that you're having, you can book a private reading with me. All of that info is below. And the best way to be notified as to when I put out any new content is by following me on Instagram. The link is below. Thank you for watching and take care.